No way. Megan asks a photo op with Princess Catherine to repair her reputation, never in the same room. If you can't beat them, then you might as well join them. Even though Princess Catherine probably wants nothing to do with Meghan Markle, let alone talk to her or be in the same room with her. It seems like the Markle is so desperate to have a sister-in-law back in her life. In fact, Meghan knows that the only way that she can repair her reputation in the UK is if she shows the world that she and the Princess of Wales are allies again, but that might be easier said than done. Meghan Markle's in a bit of a pickle, but a lot of royal fans and critics already know that. The past year has not been the best year on record for her. She and Prince Harry lost millions of dollars in contracts that went bust. They were left humiliated when the claims about getting chased by the paparazzi turned out to be untrue. If that weren't enough, their feud with the royal family has gotten worse thanks to Prince Harry's tell-all book Spare. For Meghan Markle, she feels as though she has very few options in her life. Because things aren't working out for her in California and Prince Harry seems to be more miserable by the day. A source close to an insider said that Meghan knows that the only way to keep going is if they somehow fix their relationship with the royal family back in the UK. That's why she wants a photo op with Catherine. She wants to show the world and also prove to her critics that if Kate can accept her for who she is, then so can everyone else. But whether or not the Princess of Wales is willing to play Meghan Markle's PR games remains to be seen. It's going to be very hard for Harry's wife to convince the future Queen of England that she deserves to be unblocked. Watch this space. It comes as the Palace Insider suggests Meghan seems desperate for people to like her again. She's been excused for years of being difficult, bullying staff and brainwashing Harry into leaving his family, confides the courtier. She's brought nothing but negativity to a royal title, which she's determined to hang on to. Despite her denials of bullying and a poor me posture, it's going to be a monumental task to persuade people that she's done a 180 degree turnaround and is now kind and compassionate. Her best chance of rehabbing her image is to stay out of the spotlight and stop criticising the royals, but that's never going to happen. She seems addicted to the attention. I'm sure King Charles, as well as Prince William and his wife Kate, the Princess of Wales, would be thrilled if Meghan and Harry put them in royal life in the rearview mirror. But sadly, no one believes that that's going to happen. The Princess of Wales is far superior on many aspects and she already was even before we all knew that Meghan's capable of. Meghan invited celebrity strangers to a wedding. Catherine included people she knew, including the village postmaster, and stood by him during the post office scandal. And it's PR that can't even be planned, because how did Kate know this deed would shine a fine light on her 13 years later? Contrast with Meghan and her life is constant PR to prove a point, i.e. her letter to her dad, with its forks calligraphy to pull at the heartstrings as she put it to Jason. 